Okay guys, hi, YouTube land. It's your boy Kev again, and we're here now to show you another quick way of to prepare your aki. Okay, so you remember the other day we do the aki and saltfish. Bam, Jamaica national dish, now we're going to show you country national dish. So you have yourself a little salt pork strips. So I am doing this myself, so see, I just get my little piece of pork and I strip them up, cut them into strips. Okay, and I season them with my jerk and my see my chili seasoning and my purple scotch bonnet pepper. This is the hottest pepper around, and you make that marinade. You notice I have it on the cutting board, guys. Yes, because this will run out all the excess moisture and juice and whatever you just need it to be as is. Okay, guys. So I've already had my pan on see there you go and i have already boiled my aki they're draining okay so i'm just gonna cook up my pork strips now that is going to add my aki into see very fine see some nice little fine tip you can cut it even fine just like you're doing pepper steak but it is now with aki okay and trust me guys this is a wonderful meal and then you will see what I do with it. So let's stick and stay. It's your boy Kev Adventurous Food Journey Show on YouTube. And I must give shout out to my peeps at the meat market. So Mikey, big up yourself. That's my butcher. And I must big up my bummy lady. Okay. But Diana. And I must big up all the people that I get my product from when I go out fresh produce my fish people and even rainforest seafood sometimes I get certain things from them like my shrimp okay so big up all the people I'm going to show you another adventure where you can use aki and it's delicious guys and guess what I have a surprise at the end of my cooking up of this what I'm going to do with it so stick and stay for that soon go so here we are guys see there yes man so you put a little oil in your pot guys okay just like what you see in there now, make sure you swim it around so you pour it nasty. This is very hot now, okay? And you have your seasoned up pork strips, okay? You're gonna just put out that. That's nice. And then some days they are here in your kitchen when these things are kept close down, okay? Yes, man. See that? Start get brown already, not so. Start curl up and nice up. There's a real piece of aki go on it when it's finished. Okay, guys? So, you turn up the fire a little more because this is heat to cooking it. Because this is me. See it? See it? I roll up, guys. It's rolling up. Yeah. It's like you would use your little piece of corn pork. So, this is pepper pork for your aki. Okay? Okay, so. See that roll up guys? Yeah man, so we just make that one saute right there so by itself until we come back to that. And just for the ingredients, on your little pork strips, you put your jerk season, you cut up your hottest pepper where you have indigo pine, and if you have like the scotch bonnet pepper sauce like this, not the pickle pepper, the scotch bonnet walkers wood, Jamaican scotch bonnet pepper like this. You can use that instead so you know have you know if you can deal with the, the type of pepper we may use and you put your, a little bit of your sauce you know like my blended sauce so that just to give it the color you know with your browning and your this and your that way you blend up in it rub up that in it make sure so the meat drain out for a while so it now have a lot of water or from when you wash it on it okay guys and then you do what you see me do a while ago and you just wait okay so soon come again okay guys so see you know you add your little mixed vegetables okay nowadays you don't need mixed vegetables I mean, nobody tell you nothing so you have your little mixed vegetables already put over this up and i melt and now we're going to cut up our seasoning to go into our okay okay so just watch the process guys and you'll see bam Okay, remember, bam, bam, okay, remember me showing up, 
and then you put that together and then you just you understand? Remember, you know, bam. And then you just do your liquor. You're good to go. Bam, you know where you see no cut. And you're good to go, see that? Only you're ready. To the amount of acid that you're doing. If you're doing more, you put more. Bam, same thing with the tomato. But you don't cut the tomato, it's fine. Okay, see that? And some tomato slices, they leave off. Same thing, you just cut them up. You throw them in your thing. Because you will have so much things in this now, guys. It's going to be crazy. Trust me. Now, it does look good. It's a Kev Adventurous food journey, man. So, this is my recipe. A lot of people are using them liquor. You understand? You get your uh, skeleton. Skeleton done. You move up your sweet peppers. You know, you always wash your stuff then. You wash them already. So you just keep your little thing of water there, guys. And you make sure you clean out your sweet pepper good. Show that over there. Okay. And you, you cut. So you can turn it up or you can turn it down. Any which way. Any how you feel good, safe. Okay. And then you just dice them, guys. Bam, bam, bam. You know, cut them too fine. Because you want to find them when you're through. Remember, you want them to eat. Sweet so pepper just give flavor. You understand? So, stick and stay. Okay, guys, so we're over here looking in uh, pork. You don't want to start in the water. Because you don't want it too soft. Like too. You know, just like when you have a little corn pork. I see where you want your typical water for it. I uh, keep it that way there. You just want to cook while they are hungry and all the other things there. Because it kind of can char already, you know. Because remember, you cut it so fine so it is easily penetrated, you understand? So, just go and do that, man, and make that go and do what it's supposed to do. And you'll be better. You see that? Super. Okay, so you cut a little, you cut a little piece of scotch bonnet now. And use my purple pepper, me tell you, say, the pepper you need mad them. Okay? The pepper you need kill them dead. The pepper you name everything that bad you can associate with one hot pepper. You see, they might do some pepper challenge on YouTube, even with Chick Daddy. You know, me, me, me forget the name of the show. Right now, and you see, they might test different, different hot pepper sauce from all over. You see, they even test this one and a couple others from Jamaica. Yeah, these are joke compared to this pepper we are seeing us use, guys. They may a joke as any Jamaican. Okay, so now that we have prepared all of this now, see it guys? All we have to do now is just scrape this onto a little plate and then wait for our pork to get ready because we are already wash, um, boil, sorry, and a drain nicely and ready for the fire in our way. pepper pork. Okay, or our corn pepper pork that I have prepared from scratch. Normal pork, buy from the butcher shop slice fine and diced and is now frying or cooking down to soften it a little bit to put it with my aki so it's a, it's not corn pork aki dish it's my pepper pork aki dish stick and see another kev adventurous food journey remember the adventure is not just dead if you're not now we are, we are going on some adventure you have never seen this before if you have you can hit me up in that comment section or you can just hit me at constabledavid40 at gmail.com you understand and tell me say, oh missy that already and send me the video i'm betting you have never seen anybody done it like this okay all right so soon come all right, come in camera personnel and let us go and check on our pork that is going to be cooked down with our aki soon. We're going to see if it's soft up there now. We're going to test some good things for it. Wow. Let's test, let's test. You know, on the piece there. Oh, and thick piece. See the guy? Wow. We're going to see if it's cut. Woo! You see that? That is almost ready. So when this dry down now, guys, like when you don't have a soft fish or fry out. And it's dry down now, we're throwing the aki and you're gonna see the process. Okay, so stick and stay, we smoke up. Alright, see it you now guys. We get it right where we want it now. See that? Right where we want it. So 
Okay, so see there, you're hacking out guys. When you get it to this stage, see, it's not really stuck, but it's like it's frying. So try to hack it. Hack it already, did boil and drain. So we're going to hack it guys. And you just roll away hack it up. Roll away hack it. Roll away hack it guys. Roll the pot. See that? So you hack it and your pork support. So mix up in a one. And then, guess what next? Put it in a season, guys. That's your bell pepper, scallion, onion, pepper, tomato. And stir that roll, guys. I'm not really the word about it. If you act it firm, it will stand up to you. See that, guys? Wow. You have to hold the pot on the fire, be careful. And. See that? And then, last but not least, mix the vegetables. This is a nice, full, full, sunny way, guys. See that? You can eat that with a roast breadfruit, or fried breadfruit, anything you desire. Okay, guys? And then on this now, you just put a little bit of your jerk season or your black pepper, where you like. Okay, guys? So that's your, your salted pork strips with your seasoning in your aki okay so that's your pork strip salted and peppered with your aki so see the way it look like the guys yeah man so remember it's the kent adventure of food journey show and we do it here just like this all the time so we allow that make it cook a little you know just keep around five minutes and then we go okay guys so see there see there that's your Salted and peppered pork with aki. One of a kind. You do it yourself. You don't need nothing more than that, guys. Do it yourself. Do it yourself. Okay, guys? See it there? Wow. Look at that. Look at that, guys. Okay, so it's a Kev Adventurous food journey meal you understand that's your peppered and salted pork strips that you use to cook up with your aki that's another country jamaican style so just remember you have seen it here on the kev adventurous food journey you, you guys can try this for yourself let's go ahead and try it so you see it from start to finish from here cut it up to when it go into the pot and see i show you where i cut it and you see how easily it can get cut and it can eat see that guys wow look at that look at that guys look at that see that well cut and nice and you serve that with your food you serve that with your bread you serve that with your fry bami fry bread food anything you feel you serve it with well spicy and nice guys okay so see that if you have fry bread fruit like myself here, serve it with that. And if you have fry bami like myself, you can also serve it with a nice soaked and fried bami. Perfect meal. So stick and stay. You see it when it's done. Okay, guys? Yeah, man. So bigger person. Alright? So remember, you're tuned to the Cap Adventurous Food Journey Show. And it's your boy. Kevin and I'm saying thanks for watching respect big up on yourself and remember keep liking and sharing my videos and tell everybody we can tell and just remember to tell them to subscribe because I'll keep these adventurous meals coming we make something every day well maybe you have seen it before maybe a long day to see maybe you as a Jamaican and say well maybe I've been a long time to see somebody 
roast some bread food that way there and then deal with it that way there. A long time you see a man pop out in jerk pan, you have to see it all here. Stay tuned. This is the Kev Adventurous Food Journey Show. Okay, and I'm doing this for you guys. This is not about money and all of them, something like that will come and that is happening. But it's about me showing you my skills in the kitchen and entertaining you guys and helping out who don't really know it that well either. So stick and stay. Love you all. Soon come. Bye. And guess what guys? We're celebrating his birthday today. So Oh I forgot it's my birthday today. So help us wish him happy birthday and let's put it in the comment section. It's Kevin's Kevin birthday today. The Kev Adventure Show Well Master Chef. So guess what? You've been celebrating the chef birthday with him today. Okay, so let's say happy birthday to me. Happy birthday to me. Happy birthday to all who share my birthday day also out there in YouTube land. So Big up all of the Gemini them. Big up all of the Gemini them. Me know this day when the hard working people outgoing, when the progressive, all of the positive things them. If we look up, we go serious from people, serious from people, when I ramp with the money, I want to serious about life. No one, tell me, see, I like me, I tell you guys, and when I know love, when I love, especially the men, when we love a woman, she are going to know. See, if we don't love her, you are going to know. You understand the message? So let's remember this. Love you all. See you soon.